contextualize these the source images so utterly that I actually have no idea um, really what what these events or moments signif signif signified in their initial context in the news. I just troll the internet for, for imagery that strikes me. Um, or image, imagery that is striking that I save and then I save into folders and then I forget what they are. And so there's a process of forgetting that's really important. Because this is not journalism. Photojournalism has its own problems in dealing with how an event that's history making is framed by an individual and then by a news agency. And all of this stuff interests me and the way that I can parse it is through a completely lyrical, visceral, subjective medium which has centuries of pictorial baggage. Because people say, well why don't you why don't you take your own photographs and paint them? Like why do you take other people's photographs? Why do you take images that other photographers took, other authors, like, don't, is, that's problematic to some people. Um, but to me, the point, the whole point is to choose images that are public, that are part of our common culture, that glue us together, and that are, that portray events or places that we'll never experience without this kind of mediation. The images that I choose, I choose because I am engaged personally maybe not so much in terms of what their context is, but it, pictorially. Pictorially. Visceral. Wow, what a great photograph you say yes. yourself. Yes, or, oh my god, look at that, look at that fire, ah, you know? <laughs> like, you mean the sensational the sense, aspect yes, of it? Yes, like all the stuff that it's supposed to do to me, it does to me, and I let it do it to me. I'm not about resisting that. When I do these paintings, they're done in one go. That's the rule, it's my rule. It's a, it's a one go rule. Basically. Wet on wet? Wet on wet. Wet on wet. The economy of that means is it's important to me. So there's as, as little paint as possible, wet on wet, done in maybe half an hour. or an Half hour. an hour it takes you? It depends on the size of the paintings. So it's about reach. It's a kind of, it's a kind of performance piece. You know? it's, I attack the canvas. So it's sort of, it's sort of about the moment. It's about painting a, a thing that you are very familiar with and yet have for, half forgotten, except in your physical being. Does that make any sense? Because that's really, that, that's it. That's it for me.